Hello guys, welcome to another Some Guys Productions and I'm going to now share a little benchmark on this new Mac Pro 8 core uh, 2009 with Nahalem processors uh, 2.66 gigahertz and as you can see all those processors well, there's actually 8 cores, but um, 16 cores obviously come up in Mac OS because of the hyper-threading uh, in the Harlem processors. So there you go. 16 cores. <laughs> 16 virtual cores, though. There you go. Um, Alright. I'm actually using the camera to do this benchmark because, um, yeah, I don't want anything to um, interfere with it. So everything's shut down. Um, so I'm just going to go into... Geekbench, straight into Geekbench, and I'm using 64-bit uh, Geekbench, not the 32-bit version. So I'm just gonna everything you need to know about what you need to know, and run benchmarks. See that's running all eight, oh, 16 <laughs> virtual cores, there you go. And we've got it here. All right, 16,301. I have actually got 16,450. Um, don't know at one stage, but that was when I first got it. But anyway, something must slow it down. But anyway, it's not that much difference. But there you go, there's my Geekbench score for this computer. That's Pretty awesome as such. Okay. Just gonna close that off. Okay. And start all tests. Okay, it's doing the 3D test. Testing out the GDX285. Okay. Ooh. Now it's going to do a single render test. It's going to render an image just with one core. It's actually just going to use the one core there, as you can see. It's using that one there. Oh, I'm wrong. It's using this one down here using this one core down here and using none of the other cores so this is a single core test shouldn't take remarkably that long but you never know uh. Okay, that's enough music. Alright, now it's done. Yay! That took ages to do. That was the most boringest film you could ever watch. Watch now, look at what happens when you use eight cores, baby. Oh yeah. Look at all eight cores go. And we're almost done. In a few seconds, it's rendered that. There's the speed difference. It's pretty awesome. It's all done. Eight cores all used, all 16 virtual cores have been used. Awesome. Okay, so that's all speed tests for this particular program. And these are the scores at the end. 
So, OpenGL, standard test, 16,200. Uh, single render test, 3,768. And the multiple CPU render test is 23,628. So that's looking pretty sweet. Awesome. Okay. I thought I'd show you these benchmarks and uh, hope you liked it. Yay! Bye.